handcuffs to hard hats. It's a new initiative, a joint effort between the Delta County Prosecutor's Office and local unions. The idea is to help convicted offenders overcome the barriers to employment they often face. TV6's Mark Kalman today visited those starting the program. Local unions are stepping up to play a role in the changing face of rehabilitation for those who have faced serious drug addictions. We have uh, problems facing this nation, including uh, drug addiction, mass incarceration, and we got to come up with some solutions. And right here in Delta County, we've done that. We've, we've made a drug court. The community's made a commitment to building a new jail, and now the building trades are stepping forward to be part of the community and do our part. And while new programs like the drug court and angel programs seem to be successful, finding employment is a challenge that can be difficult for someone that has a criminal record, a conviction on their record, a past history with substance abuse. Through this partnership, we've found an employer that's willing to say, hey, we're gonna trust the professionals in the criminal justice system to send us candidates that are motivated to change their life. That's where the hard hats come into place, and we have training facilities all around Delta County, and we're looking at giving opportunities to somebody who needs them to come into the building trades and make a career out of construction. Handcuffs to hard hats will allow those who are completing probationary programs under the supervision of the county to take part in training with local trade and labor unions. Prosecutor Phil Strom is among those leading the way in these efforts. Express thanks, gratitude, uh, appreciation to the trades. The carpenters, painters, those have been the two skilled trades that have really stepped up most recently. If you have a business and would consider being a part of the program, contact the Delta County Prosecutor's Office. Mark Kalman reporting for TV6 News, Escanaba.